Yeah, you you read the title right. I accidentally stabbed myself with my ep, ep, with my EpiPen, bro. Now, if you don't know what an EpiPen is, this is it. Basically, this is the one I got. Um, if you ever seen in cartoons when they yeah they have they be having like allergic reaction, like whatever, whatever the allergic reaction is, like they lips get swollen, whatever, bro. You swing it and stab it in your thigh, and then. You're supposed to get all better. That's how it works in the cartoons. But yeah, that, I, I got one of those. The doctor started giving me one, giving me them and stuff like that. And it comes with a practice one, okay? A practice one that has no needle in there, just the instructions on how to do it. So I've been trying to like, like in case of an emergency, I've been trying to like just rip off the, um, the blue thing at the top first and then twist off the cap and then just I'll just be doing it whatever just to practice because it's the practice one you feel me mm. all right so let me let me explain to you why i even had it had them out in the first place so today is friday this happened last night thursday so the day before that wednesday i was eating some food i was eating some um you know just regular dinner chicken rice with pear Oh, 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 um, avocado, I forgot, um, only, I think only Jamaicans be calling it, calling it avocado's pear, if you ain't know that, Jamaicans be calling avocado pear, yeah, so that was my dinner, and for some reason, there was pepper in there too, I think it was the pepper, I don't know, me and my mom was confused, my lips was, at like, first my lips was burning, so I, yeah, that's why I thought it was the pepper, I'm like, yeah, <laughs> I'm going crazy trying to soothe my lips like it wasn't working my lips was just on fire and then and then they started getting like a little puffy not like it wasn't getting bigger but i could tell my lip my lips were like getting like more fat like more full like just like like that you know I me mean? and then on my top lip it started there was it started i started seeing these two little lumps I was like, yo, what in the world? And my mom was like, what in the world? What? And it's not like it was the first time I was eating that dinner before. I literally ate that, that same meal like two nights before that. So yeah, that was weird. So she was like, Where, where's your EpiPen? You should just have it out. Just like, cause I be having my asthma pump with me at all times. Cause I never know. She was like, yo, you got a fanny pack. You need to just start bringing that with you. Just have it out. So I was like, yeah. And in the in the box it comes with there's there's the practice one and then there's two real ones. So I put I took the practice one. I took I took the my uh, the, I took the whole entire box in their room and I took out the practice one and then I took out the one of the real ones and put it on her dresser just in case, just so she could have one and I don't have it. She'll have one too. I'll just always have one everywhere you feel me she could put it in her purse whatever so yeah that's that's crazy i i, I put i just put it right there on her dress and just and yeah that same night i was showing my mom how to use it with the practice one i was taking the blue one off let me show you what the practice one looks like so this is what the practice one looks like it has a hold on i don't know if you could see it but yeah it's a gray cap you twist it this blue thing you pop it off and then you just Swing it. I'm not gonna do it no more. I learned my lesson, but <laughs> yeah, I, I don't even want to look at that no more. But yeah, I was practicing and showing my mom how to use it just in case. You know what I'm saying? You never know. So she knows how to use it too. <sighs> so now fast forward to the next day. Yeah, it was a cool little day. We gonna eat dinner and stuff. It's dinner time now. We gonna eat dinner. My mom made ground beef with spaghetti. I had like three plates. I was dogging that food. I went crazy. But yeah, now everybody's getting ready for bed. I go in, the, I go in their room to say good night. <laughs> I go in their room to say good night, and then my little sister points at the um at the epipen. So I was like, "Oh, you you want it?" <laughs> Me not realizing that it's the real one that, and I'm the one that put it there too. Me not realizing this is the real deal. I. <laughs> 
I was like, yo, you want to try it out? Look, look, look. There's no need to look, look. Not knowing. I'm like showing her, tapping it, not knowing that there's a, this is the real deal. There's really a needle inside here, bro. Yellow cat. I, I didn't notice this at all. I take it, but thank God I didn't test it out on her. Because she's not, like, bro, I wouldn't even know what to do with myself if I, if I did it on her. Because, bro, that's really dumb. I was like, yo, you want to, you want to see, you want to... Cause I thought it was a practice one. I was gonna do it on her. Imagine how crazy that would have been if I did, did it on her, bro. I would have been. I would have felt so bad, so mad at myself. Matter of fact, this wouldn't even be a story time if I did it on her. I would have been like, that would have been terrible. But um, yeah, thank God it happened to me. Um, so I was like, yo, you wanna test it out? Blah 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 blah. Twist the cap off real fast. I take the blue thing off and bow right in my hand, right in the middle of my hand. I don't know if you could see it. Let me tap the screen. It's like a little dot in the center of my hand. That's exactly where I put it. Literally the, the center of my palm, bro. <laughs> and I didn't realize because I, I did it. And this, this is my exact thoughts when I went like that with it. I was like, in my mind, I'm like, why did, why did that hurt like that? What, what's going on? I look at the cap and realize it's yellow and I was like Oh my god, wait, this is the real deal It's real So now my mom, she's, she's over there trying to look up like what would happen to me if anything's going wrong we we look at this what we she looked it up and was like oh it says like um basically nothing that nothing's gonna happen you just injected yourself with 20 minutes worth of adrenaline worth to lift up a car which is true i really felt like i felt mad hype like <sighs> like i felt i felt i felt real energetic i never used it before it was something different and it was it was in my palm that was the thing too it was in my palm so we had to look up what would happen if i put it in my palm because it's really supposed to go in your thigh so she was looking that up and then we seen this thing it said try to avoid putting it in like your fingers or your feet or whatever because it could cause tissue death I was like, what? Uh, no. Nah. Nah. Mind you, by this time, it's like 1 a.m. I was not trying to go to no doctor. She wasn't trying to go. She had, she had a dentist. She got it. She's at her dentist appointment right now. This was last night. I wouldn't want to do that to her. I hate, I don't like the feeling of like causing trouble. You know what I'm saying? Cause I, I don't got a car. I would have, and she would want to come with me anyways, even if I had my own car. But like go to the hospital in the middle of the night I, I i don't i don't like that stuff i don't like causing extra trouble it's annoying like no not annoying it's what i just feel like it would be annoying for the other person like i don't like doing that especially for my mom she works hard i don't like cause bringing extra trouble to the table when to the stuff she already has to deal with you feel me i, I don't like it but yeah, and the website said basically the best thing to do is just sit there and do nothing. <laughs> so I'm just in my mom's bed with my little sister and her just in there. My phone is like in my room. I'm just in there like... <laughs> in the bed like this. Just trying to take deep breaths. And I, and a good thing my, my Apple my Apple Watch came in handy. It was keeping... keeping I, I put it on to keep track of my heart rate and stuff everything was cool and my mom my mom she checked my blood pressure and everything in in there because she she has the stuff and you know what i'm saying i was good i was cool my mom told me to fall asleep in their room though because she just wanted to keep her eye on me which was smart though because if i what if i just went in the room and you don't know what could happen to me but yo that you that's a scary feeling to like it was a real scary feeling to go to sleep and like be scared to go to sleep because you don't know what's gonna happen to you in your sleep it wasn't the first night I, I fell asleep like that because like um like i wouldn't say two nights ago like four nights ago 
it was like two days in the week where I was like, it was just something wrong in my breathing. I don't know what was going on. Like, like I, it felt like I had I had shorter breath. Like my chest was tight, and I took my pump, and it wasn't really if it wasn't really helping. But like I could still breathe, but it felt weird. So I was scared to go to sleep them two nights. I don't know. It was weird. And then last night I felt it again too. It was, I was like, I don't, I don't know what's gonna happen to me if I go to sleep. But it's like 1 a.m. I have to go. It was, no, it was like 2 a.m. By the time I fell asleep, and I don't know. We all ain't really sleep good because it was like it was just a weird situation, annoying. Uh, no, nah, not weird. Annoying situation. I was like, yo, I'm so dumb, bro. How I managed to how I how I managed to take a real needle and just just quick like that bro and i didn't even realize until i looked at the cat it did hurt but i just thought i just hit my hand hard i was like why it hurt like that i look at the cap it's yellow <laughs> but yeah that's the story that's all that happened thank god it wasn't nothing crazy i ain't i ain't drug my i ain't drug myself okay because Cause it was you're supposed to put it in and hold it hold it down for like three seconds. I just went like pop out, in and out. I felt it, but I think the only the reason I felt pain in my hand a little bit was just cause I literally just stabbed my hand with a needle, like literally in the middle of my hand. I'm glad I ain't touch no veins, no nothing. I'm lucky, God. Yo, God is really God is on my side. God is God is He's here. He's there, he's doing his thing, he knows what to do, he knows when to do it, you feel me? <laughs> he was protecting me last night, cause yeah. I literally, I, I, yo, look at this. Y'all can't see it, but that's crazy. That's really crazy. But yeah, that's the end of my story time. That's the end of the story. That's all that happened. And here I am today, telling you what happened, like a bozo. Stay tuned for more vids though. More vids coming soon. Yeah. Stay tuned. And if you're new, subscribe.